Hello, anyone not still living in the 1970s? We interrupt your day to bring you this announcement. Husker Ninja is in the building. Alright guys, we are here with episode 2 of the Akron Zips Dynasty here on NCAA 14. And yes, I know this isn't our next game, but I thought there's an idea I had for the series that in order to flesh it out and sort of add more depth and flavor to the series, uh, we would showcase any top five showdowns during the regular season, and then our conference championship game if we don't make it, as well as the BCS Bowl games and the national championship just to sort of go more in depth and flesh out the college football universe in this series a little bit more. So we're here. Uh, it's number two Clemson hosting number three Georgia to open the season. And that Travis ATN touchdown run was there to open the scoring. As a studio update, Temple upsets number 10 Notre Dame 27 to 14. And the Fighting Irish sure didn't wait too long to ups or to uh uphold the stereotype of them just being a bunch of overrated chokers. Elsewhere, number 19 Syracuse beats number 12 Penn State 31-24. Iowa beats Northern Illinois 28-10. And Cal upsets number 24 Northwestern 31-28. And right there, Fromm's pass is going to be picked off going the other way for Clemson. And, you know... Short field for this Tigers offense is generally uh, something that I would recommend avoiding at all costs. All right, there it goes Trevor Lawrence into the end zone, and Clemson's up 14-0 midway through the first. But Georgia looking to have the answer from going deep, has his man in the end zone, and that'll be a touchdown to Tyler Simmons. And later on, we're now early second quarter. It's 17-7 now in favor of Clemson. But there's a big play right there for this Georgia offense down inside the 15. A big time pass play right there. And I believe that was Holloway. And later on they would go ahead and run that one into the end zone. Cut this to a three point ball game. So we've had a pretty entertaining game so far. But uh, on a third and 12. They go deep. They got a man wide open. And that's going to be T. Higgins inside the 15. And Clemson would go ahead and take advantage. They would hand this one up to Feaster. And Tavian Feaster is going to get this one into the end zone and extend Clemson's lead to two scores. Later on, it's 27-14. Right there, they're going to throw that one out in the flat to uh, the open man, Galloway, and he's got the touchdown. So it's a 20-point game going into halftime here, mid-third quarter now, still 34-14. That's really the first, and spoiler alert, but really the only mistake Clemson will make all day. Now they're up by 17 after a Georgia field goal. Then they throw that one to the end zone, and there goes T. Higgins with the touchdown. And Clemson looks scary good today. Like They were legitimate. And I will honestly be surprised if they do not finish the regular season undefeated. They just completely and thoroughly stomped the number three Georgia Bulldogs, and they just completely massacred all of their hopes and dreams. And so, you know, a touchdown right there for Georgia. I'll cut this one to a 20-point game, but it's still far too little, far too late, and Clemson's going to kick a field goal there, and I believe that would end up being the final score, 47-24. to 24. But, um, yeah, I mean, let me know in the comments what you think of this idea. I just thought it would add a little more depth and a little and flesh out this series a little bit more. That'll do it for me and I will see you guys next time. Have a great day everybody.